I've got an exciting announcement to make. I'm launching a video series related to reinventing organizations called Insights for the Journey. It will be a hundred short videos in total of uh, five to 10, 15 minutes. Um, and, you know, I'm surprised by this because when I wrote the book, Reinventing Organizations, I thought I was done with the topic. Um, but since the book came out, I've had a number of really interesting conversations with CEO who are on a bold path of transformation with their organization. And across the conversations, I noticed some interesting patterns. You know, there are a number of misunderstandings that show up often, um, a number of pitfalls that quite a few of these organizations fell into, um, a number of questions that, you know, came back and again and again in the conversations. Um, they told me of events that played out in similar ways um, and of, you know, approaches and, and ideas that seem to work really well um, across a number of different organizations. And, and suddenly I found my notebook full of interesting insights. And at some point I felt like I, I have to share this. Now, these insights have no pretense of statistical validity. Um, I didn't do a systematic research. I'm simply sharing some patterns I've noticed, you know, and insights that emerged in these conversations I've had. And, and in case you wonder, you know, this is not a repackaging of the same content of the book Reinventing Organizations. Um, in the book, I was, I was looking to answer the question, you know, is it possible to structure and run organizations in a whole new, you know, more life-giving way? And, you know, I, I believe the answer to that question is now pretty obvious. No, yes, we can. Um, but that opens up a whole new question. Um, and that is, you know, but, but then how do you do it? You know, how do you transform an existing organization of 100 or 1,000 or 100,000 people? You know, this is a whole new field of inquiry, a whole new field of things to learn that is opening um, right in front of our eyes. And the exciting thing is that there are now so many organizations taking that journey um, that we're starting to see some answers come into focus. And this video series is my contribution to this new field. Um, you know, the, the videos are meant first and foremost for those of you who are in organizations uh, making the leap. And my hope is that you'll look through the list of, uh, of videos and spot the ones you know, that field might be talking you know, exactly to where you're at in the journey. Some of the questions you might have, some of the pitfalls you might be falling into, some of the great ideas you didn't know you, know, you were about to stumble upon. I believe the videos can also be really useful uh, for those of you who are coaches and consultants and facilitators. Um, I could see you binge watching um, the entire series, um, you know, taking copious notes, uh, see what resonates and what doesn't, and turn this into a pretty content-rich training course. Um, yeah, one word on, on the format. Um, I've chosen to share this content not as a book this time, but as a video series, um, because I figured you know it would be much easier and more fun for me to just you know speak into a camera. Um, I also figured it would be much easier for you to share, you know, if you find a video that's relevant for you, um, you know, just you know share it and send it out to everyone in your organization and start a conversation. Um, you know, that certainly beats photocopying three pages of a book and then trying to disseminate that. What I do here is pretty low tech and home brewed. You know, it's, I, I set up a camera, I shoot, um, perhaps I'll add a little intro and ending that I create myself and, um, and I just share it with you. Um, it's not scripted, it's not rehearsed. Um, so I'm simply speaking into the camera and you know, forgive my hopefully not too frequent fumbling and hesitations. Um, you know, if I were to do it any more you know, polished or scripted than that, you know, I, I wouldn't have the energy to go through the whole series. Um, I hope to create maybe one or two videos a week. Um, so, you know, whatever rhythm feels right. So slow, slowly but surely, I'll work my way through the list of 100 videos. Um, I'm happy to take special requests um, or, you know, change the order um, if there's something that you particularly want to see. Um, and one last thing, uh, there is no paywall to access these videos. They live in the gift economy, so 
uh, please be generous in gifting back what feels right and help me continue doing this work. I hope you find these insights for the journey as interesting as I do and that they're meaningful and practical and valuable for the journey you're on.